While Resilient has integration with virtually every major SIEM out there and many other security products, this video uh, provided to me by Carlos Alpuerto is going to be showing the specific integration of Resilient and Curator. Here we have two particular offenses. Uh, they are related with, uh, say, this one with uh, ransomware. So instead of having uh, the person at the SOC level to manage the how to deal with this incident or ransomware, if you have resilient, you're going to have a lot of flexibility on the workflow process to deal with it. So if I take that particular offense and click in this icon sent to resilient, and the template I'm going to use that specify the things that I have customized here to look for, I get sent into straight into the curator into the resilient uh, console itself where I have some of the fields are grayed out as part of the template and some of the fields that I can actually uh, select uh, what uh, what to uh, to do with it so I can go ahead and create a new incident based on this particular uh, uh, act of uh, ransomware and by just doing that I'm presented with a playbook of all the different actions that I, my company wants me to perform to successfully and rapidly close this incident in the best way uh, possible. It is well known that when, when you deal with a security incident, if you do it in a, in a manner that is professional and fast, your reputation actually may even go up uh, as a consequence of the great way that you dealt with the actual incident and by clicking in the artifacts tab I can actually see the elements of information that were sent from curator automatically into resilient no more copy paste no more of looking in binders for procedures to be done all these can be nicely automated in fact there are some customers who looks at the offenses uh, from the uh, resilient standpoint and they don't necessarily have to look at the in the curator offenses because in here even somebody who is not well trained into the actions to be taken on these particular incidents they can actually do so by just following uh, this uh, actually playbook and there are additional things instead of going back and forth in, in, to curator you can actually perform uh, searches in curator to for additional information that you need to complement uh, your particular uh, case this integration was actually very simple to, to be done I, all, all I have to do is download the resilient app from the app exchange and install it by just clicking on the zip file that comes with it and then the definitions I mean that, that act creates this icon and in in the first part you specify the access the token and the the resilient uh, IP address or host name you know user ID and password um, all that basic stuff in the escalation processes where you define what type of templates do you actually uh, want to uh, to uh, embed the communication into frame the communication into it and this actually is a very interesting area in which you may define that some particular uh, incidents automatically not even manually automatically gets escalated into resilient and those are the ones that I was mentioned before that some customers actually have some cases for like ransomware and things that they know that in resilient is well defined what you need to do to close those incidents those automatically get sent into into resilient uh, for uh, for the escalation and in the preference sections you do things like well uh, you can enable uh, searches uh, from resilient into curator uh, eliminate that back and forth uh, you 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 can actually get all the information you need for curator uh, from here you can do things like well i want to synchronize the node between the two products i want to in if you select this one uh, when i close an offense uh, in in curator the incident gets actually closed or vice versa or both when i close the incident in resilient then the offense uh, get, get, is uh, closed as well Again, a fantastic way of really automating the closing of the incident with a well-defined playbook, all the reporting for upper management and for the compliance uh, to prove that you dealt with the incident in the best and fastest way uh, possible because we all have incidents. It, what, how we react to them is what defines which are the organizations that are more professional on dealing with security than others.